You worked incredibly closely with your co-star, Gregory, who plays Sergei. It really has been an important thing, not just for me, but for the audiences, for hearing audiences, to really see the deaf, the deaf experience that is shown within the film. And it feels like there's been a tremendous amount of respect for the deaf community at large from the audiences who are enjoying this film. And I feel that that from my participation within this film project, which is so unique and so different, that deaf people have never been represented in that way before, it really gave me a sense of freedom for the rest of my career as well. Hi, I'm Kim Taylor Bennett, and welcome to this episode of Vice Talks Film. Today I'm joined by actress Yana Novakova, who is the star of the critically acclaimed award-winning film, The Tribe. Now this film is remarkable for many reasons, but one of them is that there's no spoken dialogue, there's no subtitles, and it stars an entirely deaf cast. Hi, Yana, thanks for joining us today. So you initially auditioned to be a part of the Kiev Theatre Company and you didn't make it through, but this is where the director, Miroslav Shlobopitsky, saw you and then I guess gave you the script. What was it like when you read that script and were there any particular parts of it that you found shocking or moving? And I understand that you actually broke up with your boyfriend before the 
before you took on this film because he disapproved of the role and, you know, you went to the gym, you really, like, committed yourself to this part. Is that right? Out the door. There we go. I think you made the right decision there. Um, <laughs> Blue is the warmest color. It was an extremely influential film for you. And I wondered what about that film particularly spoke to you and inspired you to take this path? Your role is particularly pivotal, and there are a lot of extremely intimate, raw scenes, uh, some of which I had to watch with my hands over my face um, because it, it was just extremely uncomfortable. Um, how did you prepare to take on this role and prepare yourself for the scenes where you're completely exposed? So the shoot went on for six months in, it seemed like the freezing Ukrainian winter. Um, what was the atmosphere like on set? And um, I imagine that you guys, the cast, bonded really uh, intimately by the end of it.
I heard that you went to a boarding school as well, and I was curious if any of the elements of the script or storyline were things that you had perhaps experienced in your own school life, possibly on a slightly less dramatic scale, but I was wondering if there was any correlation. You worked incredibly closely with your co-star, Gregory, who plays Sergei. Um, he seems like an interesting guy, interested in graffiti and poetry and parkour. I mean, what was the experience like working with him and, you know, what did you guys learn from each other? One of the beautiful things about the film are the incredibly long single takes, which I imagine must have meant that the filming time kind of extended and extended and extended. Was it hard to, to shoot like that? Miroslav has been very explicit about not wanting this film to be released with subtitles. Are you in agreement with this? Do you think it is better that the viewer is just left to interpret the story as he or she sees fit?
So the tribe has won over 37 awards, um, but it was not submitted for the Oscars for a uh, foreign film, best foreign film. Are you pissed off about that? Seems like a bit of a crime. So Miroslav, yeah, <laughs> Miroslav considers this film um, a social victory for the deaf community. Do you feel the same way? What does this film mean to you, not just personally, but in a broader sense? This is like an incredibly broad, almost silly film question, but like what do you think, or what would you like audiences to take away from the tribe? Now I'm sure this film has opened up a lot of doors for you in terms of your career. I'd love to hear what's next for you and what you're working on in the future. This has been a very interesting experience. Personally, your uh, performance was incredibly powerful and you were so brave to take on this role and it's a really astonishing film, so congratulations. Thank you. <laughs>